Hello my soccer universe for another New Jersey reveal. Yes, it was Father's Day and yes, I'm wearing club jersey and I have Nations League background. It's just the way it happened. Uh, but I think I can justify both of these. As I said, half of my Father's Day present you actually saw already because half of it was definitely us going to Vienna, which was a big Father's Day present and watched the game against France. Um, then we also, and I said in the review video, but I know uh, by the statistic that most people uh, are watching more the unpacking videos than my match review videos. I had actually a jacket ordered for that game as well, not only the Austria jersey, but also the walker jacket for me and my wife so that we can walk. It arrived literally at the same time as when we arrived in Vienna. So I have it late, but you know, it was not so bad because with all the smoking around, uh, it would have been a, a pity. So. I wanted to have this jacket. Uh, I really love this. If this was, I said it, if this was the design for the third jersey uh, or for a black jersey for Aus Austria, I would definitely get it as, as well. It's really spectacular, if you ask me. I'm very happy to have it. It has huge pockets. However, I'm wearing a Milan jersey because for Father's Day, you remember the unpacking I did for classic football shorts where the Southampton shirt was in there? Yeah, there was another shirt in there, which was my Father's Day present, and it is a Milan jersey. I have already unpacking. There's no unpacking video. I decided yesterday uh, to tell my family, let's just um, let's just uh, do the sales at the sales celebrations, take a few pictures. But uh, if you must, but you know, I don't need to have a video because I will show it to you. Um, and you know, I got a few nice presents from my girls as well, who of course crafted a few things in school. So it was really really nice. Uh, and then, yes, uh, there has to be a jersey. And I chose this one classic football shirts because uh, it is a jersey that I actually wanted to have quite a while. It's a Puma jersey. It's from the same season as this one, 1920. It's this Puma third jersey, um, which honestly, I think is the best third jersey that Milan had uh, since Puma. And this is the best home, 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 home jersey. Overall, the look uh, for Puma in the 1920 season was really, really good. Maybe the away jersey was a little bit odd. Uh, but this one I always like, although the pattern looks very, very, very random. You would agree with me. Uh, if you don't know it already, uh, it is the perfect jersey for Milan, who are of course uh, called Il Diavolo, the devil. And there's a devil on there. And if you don't see it from here, I overlay here now on the screen. Uh, the design a little bit made clearer. Uh, this is from Footy Headlines. And then here you have actually the devil logo. And let's switch back. Now you probably see it, the devil a little bit better. And now here is the entire jersey. So really, really nice design, I have to say. Once you know, I mean, when I first saw it, what is this? But when you look a little bit closer and you know this, this actually becomes a really, really cool jersey. So again, here are the horns, here kind of the ears, the eye, the mouth, the little goatee beard and all the kind of um, parts around. So uh, makes it a really standout jersey. But what makes this particular jersey standout jersey, you already see the Italian flag. No, this is not the standout part. I actually, uh, as long as they're not winning the championship or playing for the championship, I'm not very happy with the Italian flag, but I think it fits in, in, in a way nicely. But I need it. This is a rare one where I get a name set for Milan. I have only two jerseys, me Milan jerseys, jerseys with a name set, both with Maldini. I needed to get an Ibrahimovic. And given that this was the jersey that he first played in uh, for Milan when he uh, returned, uh, it seemed to be the perfect fit. And it's also an unusual number for him, the 21. I never really necessarily liked the numbering style there. But uh, with him, it turned around in many, many ways. No, he was not the crucial candidate for uh, the for the title. But he was very crucial in turning Milan around and making them a winning outfit again. And so I said, and you know, I always liked Ibra. I always liked Ibra. Even when he went, when he went, when he was playing for Inter. I mean, I lost my love almost, but I, I always liked him because I, I, I really thought, thought he was an excellent, uh, amazing player. And then having him for Milan and, you know, I even like his general attitude at PSG, Man U, uh, a Galaxy. I just, I really liked him. So I always wanted to have an Ibra shirt. Finally, we have an Ibra uh, in the collection. And yeah, uh, he, is, he is a player that even my wife very much recognizes and very much likes as well in many, many, many ways. So yeah, uh, it seemed to be the perfect present. And 
Uh, no, my hairstyle is not based on Ibra. It's just because I want to get good hair long, but my wife always calls me her Ibra. Yeah, a little bit less muscle, but other than that, maybe, maybe. I love it. Absolutely love it. I'm so happy with this shirt. It is a it it is actually a really really cool jersey, one that I wanted to have for a long time. I saw it for a tad cheaper in second hand. Uh, with Romagnoli, but I really, uh, not that I, I never disliked Romagnoli, but I never felt right that my only other um, namesake, no, I actually have a Nesta as well, uh, but I, 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 it never felt right that my uh, namesake would have been um, uh, Romagnoli, who, good defender, solid, but nothing extra or ordinary. Extraordinary, that's how I would describe Ibra. So again, here the jersey. Here the name set, I especially like the mark on there, it's very, very important. And 20 and 2021, uh, I don't think I have a jersey with number 2021 either, so uh, that adds to it. So in any case, please let me know what you think, think about this jersey. My 1920 collection uh, is only the an away jersey short and potentially the um, 120 year jer jer jersey, although I was not a big fan of that one. In any case, give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video, subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like these and I will talk to you soon. Bye! I really hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you might enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel as it will keep you updated on all the things that are rotating in my soccer universe. And with that, I'm going to wish you a wonderful day.